asleep. What's up, guys? My name's Ariana, and today I am watching John Wick for the very first time. If you want to check out my full reaction to the movie, check us out on Patreon, and then like and subscribe. Hey, you. Do you like fornicating? Of course you like fornicating. And that's why this episode is brought to you by AdamandEve.com. Because Adam and Eve is a one-stop shop for all of your bedroom needs. But how do you feel about customer service? Ah, you probably don't care about customer service. Fool! Everyone cares about customer service. And that's why Adam and Eve will take care of your customer service needs 24-7. Check your calendar. That's every day. But what could you possibly need customer service for? Well, the customer service reps at Adam and Eve will handle things for you. Like 90-day no-hassle returns, for instance. Now you're feeling a little worried to order some things to spice up the bedroom and your neighbors are going to think that you're a freak? Well, have no worry about that because Adam and Eve always use a discreet packaging. They know what they're doing. They've been in the game for over 50 years. So stop having boring sex and head on over to adamandeve.com. And while you're at it, use code REACT to get 50% off one item. Adam and Eve, get some. What? So why did that scare me so much? Oh God. Oh no. Oh, he's already bloody? What is going on? What are you doing, John? Oh, he wants that to be like his last moment. <sighs> are you still filming? What a way to open a movie. <laughs> That's a gorgeous home though, oh my god. Oh, so she's sick or was sick Oof. Oof. has to be hard so I'm assuming you took her off life support random figure in the shadows it's been a while oh just checking up on an old friend I highly doubt that Goodbye, John. I can only think. I know this is sad, but all I can think about is the Green Goblin when I see him. <laughs> the Tobey Maguire Spider Man movies were always my favorite, but the new ones have been so good too. Sign here, please. I'm assuming the Daisy like signifies his wife. I'm sorry I can't be there for you, but you still need something. Someone to love. So start with this. Because the card doesn't count. I love you, John. This illness has loomed over us for a long time. Oh, so she knew she was sick. Your best friend, <laughs> Helen. Oh, look at the puppy! Oh. Oh, I have chills. Oof. Oh my god, he's so cute. <laughs> Oh, I want a puppy so bad. Sorry. Very standard, but how cute are you? Daisy. <gasps> oh, see, I could never, like, if I got my own puppy, like, like, as a puppy, I could never put it on the ground. Look how cute she is. I'm up. Oh man. Oh. Sorry, obviously I'm a dog lover and I really want my own like baby puppy so bad. I love rescuing dogs, but I've never had a puppy. And I want a puppy. You gonna give the puppy cereal? Oh my god, why is that so adorable? I wonder what he does, because it's a really nice house. <laughs> Nice ride. How much? She's not for sale. Oh, I love dogs. I want a suka yet. You have good day, sir. Mm, that was a very odd encounter. Also, you're a punk. 
just like taking it on joyride like on the tarmac like just for fun i mean he's a grieving man so i could see the joy in doing donuts really fast in a safe area oof it's a little push and luck though but also makes a lot of sense at the opening scene where he like gets really close to that I mean, he hits it, but it's like... All right, come on then. <laughs> Onto the bed. Oh, I can just tell that puppy's so soft. Oof. <gasps> How do they... F oh! <laughs> This is a really messed up, like, opening of a movie. I'm assuming they like saw the plates random found whatever and then you literally did it to steal a car because you felt slightly disrespected oh my god you killed his dog is it here <sighs> Joseph Tarasov nicked it legal son yeah you don't know me punk I work with your father, all right? Put him in his place. The owner of the car, you, did you kill him or what? No. You sure as hell huh. fucked up his dog. <laughs> you fucked up his dog, that's what you did. You yeah. fucked up his dog. Yeah. All, you, that's just crazy <laughs> shit, man. <laughs> so what are you gonna do? Who is he still? I'm assuming he's gotta, he knows him. He's gotta know something. struck my son yes sir I did yeah, may I ask why yeah well because he stole John Wick's car sir and uh, killed his dog oh <laughs> okay this is a big deal then also who fucks up a puppy like at the very least just steal the puppy you don't fucking kill it have you seen my son that's a nice jacket Thanks. Yeah. Oh! Oh! What did I do? Your friend Nulls up a pole me. So I stole the fucking car! Get the fuck, Viggo! Right, you stay! Why does he have to stay? It's not what you did, son, that angers me so. It's who you did it to. The fucking nobody? That fucking nobody is John Wick. We call him Baba Yaga. The boogeyman? Well, John wasn't exactly the boogeyman. He was the one you sent to kill the fucking boogeyman. Oh, shit. Oh. And then my son, a few days after his wife died, I killed his fucking dog. Father, I can make this right. How do you plan that? By finishing what I started. What the fuck? I didn't hear a fucking word I said. Papa, you have so bravo, Papa Jalos. You we said. John will come for you. And you will do nothing because you can do nothing. 
Get the fuck out of my sight. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Hello, John. I heard about your wife. I'm sorry. My condolences. Bad fucking luck caused our paths to cross once again. Let us not resort to our baser instincts and handle this like civilized men to move on. Mm. What do you say? Nothing. Enough. <laughs> How many? How many do you have? Mm. This is very daunting. Take the children that don't behave. So he was like a top tier hitman, is what I'm taking from this. Oh, fuck him up. Wow. Oh my gosh, he's gonna stab him with his own. Ooh. Oh, that noise. Oh. Oh, wow. We're just gonna put the gun behind our back. Evening, John. Evening, Jimmy. Noise complaint. Noise complaint. Hmm. You, uh, working again? No, just sorting some stuff out. Why is this so casual? <laughs> it's because it's Jersey. <laughs> I'm so confused. Good night, John. Good night, Jimmy. <gasps> Why was that so easy? <laughs> this is Wick. Yes, John Wick, that's right. I'd like to make a dinner reservation for 12. Hmm, I wonder what the gold signifies. Or if it's just gold. Good to see you, John. Clean up crew. Yep. I'm like still kind of really fucked up about that dog. And because it was like the last thing his wife, who he got out of the business for, gave to him. Like, this is like hitting me on a really like intense level right now. <laughs> Will I be hearing from you anytime soon? Oh, I love how they kind of just kept the like splatter on him. Put a contract on John Wick. Mm. How much? Too many. Put yourself. In the red circle and wait. For it. For John Wake, of course. Thank you. Carrie. What do I know this visit? <laughs> He's like, what is this? <laughs> Would you kill John Wick for two million dollars? Consider it done. Thank you, Marcus. I know I can trust you. Thanks for the drive. I wonder if it, there's like sports in it since it's not exclusive and it's open, so it's like more of a competition. Room 980. Do enjoy your stay. Thanks. I have you for two nights. Depending on business, it may be more. Hmm. Huh. But he knew the woman, so I wonder if this is like a hideout for like hitmen. Or people in the, like the industry. Clearly, it is. You gotta put a gold coin in to get in. It's a 
club for wise guys. Hello, Winston. Jonathan. Yosef Terasov. I'd like to talk with him. A talk? You say? Have you returned to the fold? Just visiting. Hmm. You dip so much as a pinky back into this pond. You may well find something reaches out and drags you back into its depths. Where do I find him? Makes a lot of sense. If they're willing to break the rules of Continental, double the bounty. How long has it been? Four years? Five and change. Mm. So tell me. Mm. Oh, so he only had his wife for like five years? It's either her or the other girl at the contact. Oh, they went and lured to the red circle. Got it. And so she gave him the tip that this is the red circle, I'm going to assume. So they are all working together. Hello, Francis. Why don't you take the night off? Thank you, sir. Oh, you scared as shit, as you should be. Oof. Oh, you're using her as a human shield. That's kind of fucked, bro. <laughs> Oh my god, there's so many like partying around them still. Ugh. Damn. Holy shit. Mm. Oh! Oh shit, dude. Ooh. Oh. How is his back not broken? Victor's dead. Mm. Oh, he is fucked up. He's a doctor, and yes, sir. 24-7. How good's your laundry? I'm sorry to say that no one's that good. <laughs> no. I thought not. No, I thought not. Oof. Your stitches will tear and you'll bleed. <laughs> but you'll have full function. Oh shit, I was wondering when he was gonna show back up. Isn't this supposed to like to be a safe haven? I guess he's on the outside. They're not conducting business in there. So I guess that might not count, huh? Oh, it's the girl, isn't it? Knew it. Hey, Knew it. Shady bitch. Wow, that's too fucking easy. Vigo's giving me four to break hotel rules. That's a voice I got shoot you. <laughs> what a life. So is Marcus protecting him or just trying to get the money for himself? Oh, fuck. 
Oh. Yes. We have received a number of grievances from your floor concerning the noise. My apologies. I was dealing with an uninvited guest. A dinner reservation, perhaps? Joseph. Oh, fuck you. Little Russia. There's a church near Cannon Court. It's where Vigo keeps his private stash. Yeah, knock her out. Do I know you? I'm thinking so. Everything's fine. I'll do you too with that. <laughs> it's so, like, transactional. Baby sitting asleep in one. Catch and release. Catch and release. A Marcus in a shawl. I feel like someone's always posing as a woman in a church. <laughs> and that angle looked very suspect. Oh, no, it's an actual woman. Okay. Oh, that doesn't say much about him. Zanayu. Let's go to the vault. Bye. Vigo will kill me. You're already about to get killed, bro. Uh huh. <laughs> that was a great line. <laughs> Honestly, what do you think you're going to do with all of that? This. Ooh. Ooh, you're going to disrespect his cash like that? Oh, wow, you're really just in it to get revenge. I love it. Mmm. Don't worry. Housekeeping will find you. Treat all your ladies like this? You are no lady. <laughs> Just break. I'm dislocating your thumb to get out. Oh no! She's a cunt. Don't worry. Housekeeping will find you. Oh, I used a hard C there. Can we recover for this? Viggo, you know what was in that vault, right? It's not. Oh, you, do you even have Vigo in the car? Did I miss it? Is he in the car? Oh, fuck. Okay, so he's not in the car. He just was taking him out with the car. All right, all right. I say this, John. The shore is fuck broke the mold with you. Evidence black, but it was fucking priceless. Priceless! Yeah. I kind of enjoyed it. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I know you did. Yeah, while well, you had your wife, I had my son. And believe me, you had a far better <laughs> deal. Because <laughs> your son's a dick. A lot of us are rewarded for our misdeeds, which is why God took your oh, wife. Oh, wow. Links to you. What's that say about you then, bro? We are mm. cursed, you and okay, I. Okay, cool. He's including himself. On that, we agree. Give me your son. A final gift for my wife. In that moment, I received some semblance of hope. And your son took that from me. Oh God. People keep asking if I'm back. But now, yeah, I'm thinking I'm back. So you can either hand over your yeah. son, or you can die screaming alongside him. So does he just, like, have John's back then? Like... Because it seems to be helping him out an awful lot. Or is he just really trying to get this two million for himself? Mm. It's insane that he's doing this in handcuffs. 
Then if I tell you where he is, you let me walk away. He's kept in a safe house, Brooklyn. They know you're coming. Of course. But it won't matter. Mm. Also, you have no honor, sir. Just throwing that out there. I mean, he's a mobster. What honor could he possibly have? But stop playing the fucking video game. No! Oh! How clean! Holy cow! Oh. <laughs> but it wasn't just a fucking dog. Like, it wasn't. I'm sorry that you don't understand sentiment and all that jazz. Because you, too, are the definition of lacking honor, so... <laughs> mm. So I'm assuming this is where... Make the arrangements. Like you shouldn't trust that car, but I don't know. How many times do I have to save your ass? Hmm. I appreciate it. Oh, this bitch. Well, this is messed up. He saved his ass and then. Hello, Marcus. Yep. Cause she ratted him out, cause she's a bitch. Ugh. If you have done your job, my son will be still alive. In for a penny, in for a pound. I always liked you, Marcus. <sighs> Fuck her up. Ugh. Well played, old friend. Yeah. Fuel the chopper. I just, this poor guy, he's just going through it. Obviously, he was a bad guy before, so it's hard, but there you go. Wow. Oh, yeah, you, you get what you deserve, bitch. Your membership to the Continental has been by thine own hand revoked. Greed. <laughs> There's a cleanup guy, just right there. Oh wow. We live by a code, which is why I'm not the one telling you it was a certain helicopter, a certain helipad is being fueled for a certain someone. Mm. So that's where we end up, where the movie opened. Oh fuck. Ooh. <laughs> God damn, I knew he'd come. Fucking wrong with this guy. Oh! Good luck. Russian cocksucker. Oh, you shot one thing. Like, what? Why did you get cocky that fast? Like, what is wrong with you? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Ooh, that's lucky. Oof. Oof, oof, oof. No more guns, dog. No more bullets. No more bullets. We were prepared. 
Oh, brought a knife. Ooh! Ooh! <laughs> Feels like a whole lot of pain for both of them. You see me, John. Mm. You see me. Wow. Mm. Let's go home. Mm, is he gonna get up? Out a guy. Out a guy. Oh, is he gonna go get another puppy? No, he's gonna patch himself up. Duh. <laughs> God, I suck. I'm like, I'm only here for the dog. Oof. Himself a little pit bull. Yes. Now he has a rescue. Oh. Yeah. Okay. 